Hello everyone, my name is John. Today I will tell you how to set up integration to transfer new leads from Webflow to Agile CRM. This is necessary to automatically transfer new leads from Webflow to other systems. For example, in Agile CRM you can create new contacts and conveniently work with them in the future. Now let's move on to the setup. First you need to create a new connection. Next, select the data source system, Webflow. Now, select the action, Get Form Data. At this stage you need to connect your Webflow account to the Apex Drive service. In this window you must specify the login and password of your Webflow personal account. At this stage we provide Apex Drive access to your workspace Webflow. When the connected login appears in the list of active accounts, select it and click Continue. At this stage, we select the website from which we will receive new leads. At this stage you can set up a data filter, in this case there is no need for this, so we also click Continue. At this point you should see data for one of your Webflow leads. If there is no data at this stage, you need to fill out a form on the Webflow website. To do this, go to your Webflow personal account. When the form on the site is completed, we return to the Apex Drive system and continue configuration. When the Webflow lead is displayed at this stage, click Continue. At this point, setting up the Webflow data source has been successfully completed, now you need to move on to setting up the data destination. Choose Agile CRM system. Next, select an action. Create contact. At this stage you need to connect your Agile CRM account to the Apex Drive system. In this window you must specify the domain, login and API key. To get this data go to your Agile CRM personal account. Copy the domain from the address bar, without additional characters. Next, specify the Agile CRM login. To get an API key, go back to your Agile CRM personal account. Go to Profile Settings. Then go to the Developer's API section. Copy the REST API and paste it into the appropriate field in the Apex Drive system. When the required fields are filled in, click Continue. When the connected account appears in the list of active accounts, select it and click Continue. At this point, you see the Agile CRM fields for creating new contacts. You can assign variables from Webflow to these fields. In order to do this, click in the field and select a variable from the drop-down list. Please note that you can use not only variables, but also enter values manually. When the required fields are filled in, click Continue. At this point you see an example of the data that will be sent to Agile CRM in the form of new contacts for each new lead from Webflow. If you are not satisfied with something, click Edit and you will go back a step. In order to check the correctness of the settings, click Send Test Data to Agile CRM. After successful submission, go to Agile CRM and check the result. If you are satisfied with everything, return to the Apex Drive service and continue setting up. This completes the setup of Agile CRM as a data destination.
Now you need to enable auto update and select an update interval, for example, once every 5 minutes. That's all, I wish you successful integration settings and good luck.